They're putting stuff together. Who? The insurance woman, Baldrica. They, they think that we did it together. A jealous mistress. An unfaithful husband. Gambling debts. That's how you think they see us? It doesn't take much imagination. Two college professors. That's how they see us. It doesn't get less threatening than that. Nobody suspects us, Rob. You've got a record. What? Are you kidding? A record? Are you kidding me? Officer Gruder told me that you have a record. I busted my kid brother out of a loony bin, okay? That's a little different than murder. I was 19. I was trying to free him. Jesus. What? It was me. What are you talking about? Can I see that picture? Thanks. See? This is an earring back. It goes to a stud earring. I don't wear studs. I'm more of like a dangle gal. You know, I like chandeliers. They move with you. They're on wires. They don't have a back. Are you finished? Excuse me. Wow. What a shithole. Hey, I think you're in the wrong place. No, you are in the wrong place. All right? You're in the wrong place. You have no idea. Oh! And who the fuck are you? You're the fuck are you. What? Huh? What are you doing here? I'm stalking you. Wait a minute, you know her? This is a professional situation and you have no right to intrude here. What kind of professional situation? This is a professional situation. Our problems have nothing to do with Sharon and they have nothing to do with him. I want you to leave right no, no, now. No, I'm not leaving. He's leaving. I fucking live here. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah? Well, neither am I. How about if I throw you the fuck out? How about if I roundhouse you upside your fat fucking head and collapse your skull? I don't know. How about I give it a shot? No, no, don't, because she knows how to do that stuff, okay? I mean, this? You, you need this? You need, like, a little freedom or something? You want to dabble? We, we can just... all have sex together. That's fine. So you're fucking out of your mind. You know you want it. Look, our situation has nothing to do with him. It's just we're over. No, we're not over. We're, we're all set up together, the three of us, so you get this out of your system. Jesus, be careful. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Meet Sheriff's Office. Yeah, and I talked to Sheriff there, please. It's Agent Wesley Dole of the FBI. Uh, he's not in right now. May I help you? Well, I got a man here in my office named Fenton Meeks. Fenton Meeks? What's he doing there? You know him? Well, yeah. He caused a bit of a ruckus here earlier. He stole an ambulance and his brother's body, too. Excuse me. Oh, didn't hear you come in. How can I help you? I'm with the FBI. I need to speak to the sheriff. Is he in? Sure thing. Sheriff? Would you like some coffee or something? No, I'm fine, thanks. Sheriff? Yeah. I'm Agent Griffin Hall, the FBI. Everything okay, Adam? Everything's just fine, Becky. God's will has been served. Oh my God! You haven't changed a bit! And she called it art. 
I mean, I swear, it looked like a giant tampon. It was an installation art piece that focused on cylindrical shapes. That is all. And pussy is cylindrical, right? <laughs> I mean, trust me, it was a tampon. Who wants coffee? Oh, come on, people. Lighten up. It was just a little bitty pussy joke, please. <laughs> Go on. All right, well, joke or no joke, I think you've had enough of this. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, bore yourself with the dinner party art talk, and I'll just sit here, think dreamy thoughts. The thing I find so interesting about Basquiat is... Oh, hey. What did Tallulah Bankhead say when somebody asked her if Montgomery Clift was gay? I don't know, darling. He never sucked my cock. This isn't working for me, okay? I don't fucking want... It. I'm tired of you mind-fucking me! We used to talk, remember that? Communicate, work things out. What the fuck is this? What the fuck was that in the car? What the fuck is all the drinking and you telling God me damn, I drink too goddamn much? Shit. I've never been this pissed off in my fucking life! Is this a good salt of the earth distraction or what? <laughs> Chickens. They're not very clean. You're not pregnant. There's got to be some other reason I'm still spotting. Sure. You were pregnant. Based on your hormone levels, you've had a miscarriage. I haven't even been on a date. Right. Since it's physically impossible to have sex without someone buying you dinner. I haven't had sex since I split up with my husband. That was almost a year ago. Immaculate conception. Um, what do I do? Well, it's obvious. Start a religion. Are they still there? Yes. Damn it, we just lost them. Does Caltrans have any cameras that are covering that area? McCarthy's right. CTU doesn't know you exist. For the love of God, all of those people's lives are on you. You did not tell me this is about nuclear bombs. What this is about is about seven million dollars. Now get in the truck! Palmer 621, all right? Don't forget it. Okay, good. It's not too far. did the right thing. Now, I've got to contact CTU and give them... Shut up! Shut up! Vestibule. <laughs> when you talk <laughs> about me. <laughs> I need a drink. Um, yeah. I, I brought some of my special brew with me. You guys want some? This what? isn't regular sugar, Mike. It's LSD. What? Acid? Uh -huh. What's the matter with you, Corinne? Mike, I didn't give it to him. They look just like fucking sugar. Okay. Okay. We need to get to a hospital. Yeah. You do know I'm getting married in two months, right? Yes, I do. You do. I do, and, and like I said before, I'm sorry. You should be. I'm really not into women. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Laura, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I think that's the best thing in this situation. I'm gonna go. 
I'm straight. She had a call back on the 12th night. Yeah, that's what she said. You think Monica lied about her call back? Oh, maybe. Why would she lie? Because she's a fucking stepdin, that's why. She doesn't always talk like one. Well, no. No, because Monica fancies herself as an actress. She's ashamed of being a stand-in. 